hi it's Jilly again with another 99p test for my 99p testing channel and um, today I have got something that I heard about um, but haven't had a chance to try but now I have one so it is the con I don't know whether it's cognac or conjac sponge um, different people say it different ways on various videos that I've seen so I'm not sure First things first, before I talk about it, I'm going to get it in some water because it's supposed to take a few minutes to soften up. So I'm going to open it. All sealed very nicely. And there it is. You can see I've got the baby doll nails on. Quite like them. That was my last video, if you haven't seen it. Um, so this is a sponge, quite hard. I have a bowl of warm water here, so I'm gonna put this in to soak while I tell you what the packet says um, for the sponge. Okay, so pop that in. Right, so that's in some hot water. So the packet, Actually, I'll tell you what the advert said, because I bought it from eBay. It says natural cognac or conjac, not sure. Um, I don't know what that says. Conu, Conupco Facial Puff Face Cleanse Washing Sponge Exfoliator. The colour I got is charcoal black. It was 99p and it came from Hong Kong. The um, seller was Doherex. D-O-H-A-I-R-X um, I'll put a link in the down bar to the actual um, product on eBay from this seller. You can get it in different colours. I got mine in charcoal black but you can get it in like a purple, green, white, the black or a yellow colour. So that's quite good. So this is what the packet says whilst that's just softening up, starting to go. So, it says that the konjac sponge is made from 100% natural konjac dietary fibre. Being unbelievably soft and gentle, it is ideal for everyone, including newborn babies. It will bring back the natural glow and softness of the skin with daily usage. It says, tip, you can add your favourite foam cleanser when using the sponge. For best results, replace the sponge every two to three months. I'm... It doesn't say to put in the instructions here, it does that's the hint to put your own soap on, but it doesn't say to use your own soap. You're supposed to be able to just use it to cleanse your face without using any product at all. So that's what I'm gonna to do today. Um and we'll just see how it goes just on its own without testing my product. We just want to test the sponge. So that's what I'm gonna do. It says it gently exfoliates to bring back the natural glow of the skin, kills acne causing bacteria, effectively balances the pH balance of the skin. Extra soft features are ideal for delicate and sensitive skin, naturally moisturises the skin and is ideal for people with atopic skin disorders or hypersensitive skin. How to use. Soak the sponge in the water for a while and press several times to expel excess water before using. Now I have watched some videos and they recommend you definitely don't twist the sponge when you're squeezing the water out of it. You just press it between your hands because otherwise you can damage the fibres and your sponge will end up falling apart. <coughs> Excuse me. It says massage gently in circular motions over face or body. You can get bigger ones for body, but I only got a little. Rinse the sponge and press gently with two hands until dry. Store and hang the sponge in a, a cool and well ventilated place to air dry properly. So, it says shelf life three years, but it hasn't got a date of when it was made, so. But we'll trust that it's okay. Oh, I've been on four minutes and I haven't even started with my face yet. Right. I'm hoping my phone doesn't fall off the stand that it's on because the bowl of water is directly underneath. That would make me cry. Right. So, circular motions. It's not scratchy. I'm not sure how exfoliating it is because it... It just feels really soft. Some of them say they've got charcoal in, 
Um, this one just says it's charcoal black as a, the colour. I'm not sure whether it's supposed to actually have any charcoal in it. But I'm not sure how that would work anyway. When they put things like that in stuff. Because obviously you're going to be rinsing it and squeezing it out and stuff. It has recommended that you put it in really hot water every couple of weeks. Like boil a kettle and put it in for a few minutes. Um just to kill any bacteria that might be on it so that it lasts you longer and doesn't start to break down or smell a bit weird um, well it feels nice I'm not sure whether I'd trust it to do a job without any soap well I don't use soap, I use um, an Ole gel wash that I really like I'll try using that a bit it feels very massagey, not so much exfoliaty. But I will give it a go. I keep trying it anyway. And that's it. So you rinse it out now. You're supposed to rinse it under running water, so I will take it through into the bathroom and give it a good rinse. But you rinse it out, squeeze it between the palms of your hands like that. Don't squeeze and twist. And then it has its own little hanging thing to so just hang it up and let it air dry naturally. I just flick water all over. Um, and that's what you do. My face doesn't even feel that wet, so I don't really need to wipe my face. So what do I think? I'm not sure that I believe that it's any better than a normal sponge, but it's quite novel and fun. And for 99p, I mean, that's what we're all about, isn't it? For 99p something novel and fun I think I might go and wash my face though I think I might use it with product I think I would feel more confident in its cleansing of my face if I use it with some product but um, yeah for 99p you can't go wrong it didn't take that long to come I haven't been waiting for ages for it I'm just going to move this water just in case I'm getting a bit paranoid um, so go and try it and see what you think try it yourself or if you've tried it um, comment on my um on the down thing and just tell me what you thought of it and whether you use it with product or you use it on its own i can see for sensitive skin it being a really good thing i don't have really sensitive skin but you know better than putting lots of harsh things on your skin isn't it so let me know um subscribe to my videos because i have more things to test and um you can also follow me on twitter uh, at Julie Bob Dandy and uh, thumbs up my video people okay so I will not see you tomorrow it's tomorrow is Sunday it is my day of rest um, so I'll do another video for Monday for you okay thanks bye